Well, we're here today. Mick's obviously joined us, thank you, Michael. Uh, but this is why we're here, because we're going to drop this conge disc into the ground to back up this is the backup earth supply for this or alternative earthing arrangements for this Tesla Powerwall 3 that we're currently wiring up and doing in now. So Mick's got the conju disc there. So what we're going to try is if we come over here, one of the reasons we don't want to put an earth rod down here is as you can see where Mick stood there, we've got two manhole covers there. There's another two manhole covers there. There's another load of manhole covers there, there's the actual street drainage there, just, just beyond there. So because of that, we don't particularly want to, um, we don't particularly want to bang an earth rod down because we have no idea what we're going to hit. So the idea of the conjure disc, if you haven't seen this before, it's an alternative to an earth spike or an earth rod. Literally, my, my word literally again, Michael is going to dig us a hole uh, about six, 700 mil down we're going to go. We're going to go as close to the meter cabinet as we can, or close to the Tesla gateway, I should say, as we can. So we're going to dig down there. Um, we're going to drop this conjure disc in, and then we've got a bag of their, their crete, their cement, the, the, the conductive material that they, that they sell with this conjure disc. Um, so we're going to put the conjure disc in. We're going to put this, this crete over the top of it, and then we're going to start doing some testing to see if it's given us the required um, readings. We're going to do that before we start backfilling it. So we want to get somewhere near, well, we want to get the right readings before we backfill it. And then once we've backfilled it and compacted it down, the readings will actually improve, they'll get better. So, um, right, as we said, new build house. Customer has kindly been out with the plans for the sewerage. Um, so we've, we've had a good look at that. And we think that based on what the plans say, where the ridge tile is uh, and where everything is marked on, we think that Mick is in the right place. So Mick's just about marking out now and he's going to start digging down just below us, uh, you can see where he's made a, a start and uh, hopefully we'll be all right and hopefully we'll, we'll miss the mains cable coming into that meter cabinet because that's not on the plan. Mick, what's happened? <laughs> cable. There we go. So, obviously we've been extremely cautious with this, extremely cautious, but as you can see, Michael has exposed the cable warning tape. So we're going to come, we can afford to come this side because the conju disc, look at this. Customers just, just arriving at the right time. We're just examining our, uh, our evidence. So fortunately, we looked at the plans that you kindly printed. Yeah. And we ascertained that this is probably the best location for us. Um, it just goes to show that had we have banged a rod down there, we could quite easily have hit a mains cable, yeah, yeah. yeah, which is why we wanted to use the conju disc on this. But Mick's, Mick's digging it as carefully as he can, um, and he's hit that. Well, he hasn't hit that, he's found that. Yeah, so. yeah, my, it's done his job though, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah. no, no. Yeah. Well, the alarming thing is, he found that tape when you come walking out of the house. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so for a minute, my heart stopped. Excuse me, should the power be? Oh, it's just power. <laughs> what? What power? No, no. <laughs> No, you're absolutely right. It, it has done its job. Yeah, yeah. So well done. And also, Mick, well done for, you know, digging cautiously. Yeah. Right, so, as we, as we established just that the cable warning tape is there. I don't know how well you can see this in the trench. In the, in the trenches, Mick? No. I'll get used to this camera one of these days. Right, there. Right, and the cable warning tape is there and then the cable is below it, but to the side. <laughs> so at least they gave us cable warning tape. Um, and they have done it properly, as you can see the different colours of the earth down there, where they've obviously put the cable in. That's not the cable, that's obviously a conduit, that, a pipe that the cable's in. But they've put it down and then they've, um, um, yeah, they've put different coloured earth back in. So we can, you know, you can see the, the colours changing so you can see what's... Hi Michael, there's Joe. Hi Joe. Hello. Hello Joe. Hello Michael. Hello. How have you got on? Well, we've got a big hole. We've got a big hole. All uh, misses. So I don't know if we can see very clearly, but we have got a nice, nice big hole in there, which Michael has dug. We've got 800 mil, haven't you? Yeah. And we can see we've actually got a waste pipe there. So, well, some kind of pipage going on, haven't we? We've got the cable, mains cable coming in as well. So it's all going on in that trench, but we've managed to get down and excavate. That's a good word. We've managed to excavate it. I say we, what I mean is Michael. 
has managed to excavate it nicely and um, we'll be able to drop our conju disc in and uh, get it tested so that's the next step so right we'll get the conju disc we'll get it ready and we'll drop it in right conju disc is actually in michael's put it in we're going to get a close-up to that in a minute but because mick's busy doing it we're going to have to have a conversation with mick's arse hi mick's arse <laughs> how's the job going it's good <laughs> brilliant right should we talk to this other i mean his face <laughs> well done right Conjure disc is down there. We're going to pour the cement on it now and then we're going to test it and see where we are. Look at Joe's well into this cameraman lark, isn't he? Mm. Have you got a magic dragon? Are you expecting a dragon or something to come out of there? Pan down there, if you can see down there. So there was a hole here earlier. Now down there is a conju disc, which is in the ground, 800 mil down. We put a bag of the conju disc cement, conductive cement on top of it. Uh, and we tested and tested, tested. And then we backfilled. Um, we tipped a bit of water on to help the cement, A, to help with con conductivity, yeah? and to help the cement filter down and fill all the gaps in and get in all the, you know, get all the earth. And then we filled it back in and the grass has gone back over the top. So you can hardly really tell that we've been there. And then we've got the cable comes up into the meter cabinet. And we're at the stage now where we have been testing this as we've been doing it, but this is going to be the last test for today. Um, I'm going to have to pop back tomorrow and bang an MET in this meter cabinet because I've not got one with me but we'll just test this now to see what we're getting. So we're basically testing a TT system, if you like, and we've got 28, which is absolutely, I'm, I'm really happy with that, to be fair. So the conju disc, let's give us 28 uh, ohms. Um, I think that's a really good result. Also, as you've seen in the video, we could have stuck a, a spike down, but we found the power cable, we found uh, the data cables, the, the broadband cable coming in, we found that under there and under there. We know there's lots of drainage, so there was a genuine reason for not wanting to just put a spike down. Turns out we were quite vindicated in not just putting a spike down. Um, and we've got a great result. So, you know, thumbs up really for the Conju disc. Thank you.